Welcome to the Geospatial Intelligence Podcast. My name is Aybar Sostuna and I'm the founder and CEO of Geospatial Intelligence Institute and Master of Science in Geospatial Intelligence candidate at Johns Hopkins University. Geospatial Intelligence an Emerging Field We'll be talking everything about it. Let's begin. GIS in Politics Mapping of the Political Landscape Geographic Information System helps analyze the relationship between environmental contexts and social inequality. GIS utilizes already available archaeological maps, which equips it to help with conducting research and studies on material and spatial boundaries based on social differences persisting in both regional and local environments. The application of GIS helps in conducting studies on various social factors that tend to affect the political environment of a specific region or country. One of the main sources of retrieving information from the general public is by conducting surveys which helps gather general public's perceptions and viewpoints. Such information holds significant value for political leaders as it would provide them with the concept that the masses have within a region or a country. It also helps in accumulating the points of concern that the public has and providing further assistance in solving them. GIS aids in constructing a methodological and theoretical framework that carries significance in the political landscapes examination. GIS in physics. Natural catastrophes tend to have a significant impact on human life. Some natural disasters can be very impactful, causing serious human damage, including increased causality and displacement rates. Geographic information system is equipped with the same technology that makes it a special information system enabling it to collect, store, and manage local physical data and international physical data of the surface space measured through the support provided by software and hardware. GIS helps in the collection of e-physical data after the occurrence of a major natural disaster. Seismic data is the result of the detection of multiple physical qualities resulting in increased seismic data with a majority of it lacking a linear relationship to meet the requirements for detection. E-artificial intelligence can be carried out through a convolutional neural network which can match the patterns in a complicated nonlinear variable. Seismic waveforms are also equipped to generate various models with general characteristics. GIS can intercept and collect seismic physical signals with an e-training and detection accuracy rate of approximately 90%. GIS in public policy. The advancements in geospatial science and geographic information systems have enabled the newly developed science to contribute to public policy formation. The latest development in geospatial science has made it central to government policymakers in all sectors and departments. A core theme of the upcoming Association of American Geographers annual meeting is held annually with its core focus in geographic information science, GIS, and public policy, which explores the expanding role of geographic information science and GIS in the public policy arena on crucial na- national issues which include immigration, healthcare facilities, civil rights, transportation, crime rate reduction, electoral redistricting, energy consumption, 
allocation of natural resources, social justice, and environmental science. The theme of geographic information science, GIS, and public policy also encompasses another dimension, which includes state and federal policy making on GIS. Association of American Geographers meeting in Tampa in 2014 included numerous segments entirely centered on two specific organizations policy making on GIS. These organizations were the Federal Geographic Data Committee and the National Geospatial Advisory Committee. The mentioned organizations were dedicated to developing strategic plans for the United States National Spatial Data Infrastructure. If you would like to have a variety of sources, feel free to follow geospecialintelligenceinstitute.org. That is geospecialintelligenceinstitute.org. My name is Ibars Östunar. This is the Geospatial Intelligence Podcast.